Usually, we don't comment on rumors, but we have verified reports that the Exiles are now in control of some sort of super weapon. The Exiles are trying to keep this quiet, so naturally, details are scarce. But, we do know that it was involved in the destruction of the Skids. If this is true, and it seems that it is, then the Exiles could easily destroy half of Portland with the push of a button. We believe this is far too much power for anyone to wield, especially a group that has time and again shown a callous disregard for innocent lives. The Breach Outreach will continue to report on the Exiles' behavior and keep them honest. You have our... my... word. Oh, uh, is that the nuke? It's it's some kind of missile. I don't know, maybe there's a nuke. Again, it would not still work. The what? nuke might. You said, Lord, he will call on me and I will answer him. I will be with him in trouble. I will deliver him and honor him. The strength to protect the helpless. To deliver them from this great evil. I'm impressed that they actually got cut. The courage in this to game. stand against the wicked. To thrust them back into hell. Let this monstrosity before me bring no harm this day. Omnia vencente lux tenebras. Stand down, purple woman. Amen. Monstra, are you are you trying to stop the nuclear weapon? Are you praying to it? I see Blackthorn has once again sent his minions to inflict more evil onto the world. It is God's will you be stopped. I, I'm not looking for a fight. I just want to stop the nuke from being used. The Lord can see through your lies. Uh, he no. knew that one day evil would try to launch this nuke. And that is why I was chosen by heaven to defend the world from this weapon of mass evil. Big mistake. I, no, oh, for God's sake. I legitimately do not want the nuclear weapon to go off. You know the worst part about cultists? Difficult to reason with. I legitimately do not want the nuclear weapon to go off. Why do you think that I'm trying to kill everyone? Goodbye, Mrs. Cult Lady. You gonna blow up? Oh, there's still someone alive. Not for long. Jeez. Okay. All now, right. Now what do we do? Well, now I have to stop the nuke from being launched, and if that means destroying it so that Tiberius doesn't launch it at somebody, then so be it. Why do you always assume the worst about it? Because Tiberius <laughs> lied. She very clearly did not want the nuclear weapon to be used. But she wouldn't listen to reason, and we had to put her down. Tiberius, I am 99% positive, has lied to us to get us to launch the nuclear weapon. She, she's dead. They're all dead. The launch codes. A yoink. I'll save a seat for you in hell, Rancor. I have a feeling we'll be meeting there real soon. <laughs> what the fuck, my guy? One loose end to worry about. <laughs> Stop being a sociopath. Weaver's dead, but we still have a few crusaders left to eliminate. How many more are there? Hi, hi. The Look, oh. I really, really don't want to kill you guys. But I guess we have no choice in the matter, so all right. I suspect that will be the last we hear of the Crusaders. Their organization will likely dissolve now that three of their roundtable members, including their head honcho, have been eliminated. Weaver won't be coming back from the dead this time. I've made sure of it. The only matter left to resolve now is the nuke. What do you suggest? Not that I care at all. Also, why is there a map of the big empty on the wall behind us? Now that we have the launch codes, we have two options. We could defuse the nuke, ensuring it can never be detonated. Or, we could launch the nuke at a select target. I would suggest we target the Legion's main HQ back in Arizona and wipe them out once and for all. However, the choice is up to you, Courier. Yeah, I'm, um, uh, I'm defusing it. You'll have to operate directly on the warhead in order to defuse it. It could expose you to a lethal dose of radiation if not properly protected. No, it won't! I saw a room with some radiation suits you could use. Probably some Rad-X and rad in there as well. You and AJ should go put on the suits. I'll see what I can find to pry open the warhead. <laughs> you mean you're going to launch the nuke from here while I'm off doing something? No, he's just looking for a crowbar. Uh-huh. <laughs> and no, working on a nuclear warhead would not 
expose you to a lethal, lethal dose of radiation. How the fuck do you think they put nuclear warheads together? Without the radiation, and then they put the radiation in afterwards. Yeah, that's exactly it. Honestly, it's fine. The, the main thing you would want to be concerned about when working with a nuclear warhead... Ooh, T-57C power armor. Neat. The main thing you'd want to be concerned what when... What the hell? Rancor's launching the nuke! Yeah, kind of We're figured... We're locked in here! How did I fucking know? We don't know that we got locked in here, and we don't know Rancor's launching the nuke! That could have been somebody else! AJ! Remember when I said he was gonna launch the nuclear weapon? You remember when I said the that? The door's open! Come on! Let's go find Rancor! He's gonna have launched the nuke at the NCR base because he was a spy! For the Legion? Of course, who the fuck else would he be a spy for? <laughs> the Crusaders? <laughs> huh. He's run off. Oh gee, what could he be up to? I don't know, but he better have a good explanation when we find him. We should report back to Camp Phoenix. They're going to want to know that a nuke has been launched. <laughs> if, unless he launched it at Camp Phoenix. Yeah, unless he launched it there. Well, let's hope for the best. Uh-oh. Hey, is that Camp Phoenix? I don't know. We wouldn't be able to hear that. I'm just, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. We wouldn't be able to hear that. Now we would hear it. Zach, you're not supposed to look at explosions. They could blind you. <sighs> also, yeah, but unless the flash was like lower than the horizon, then we would be okay. I've seen footage of atomic explosions, but I have never seen one in person before. First time for everything. I can almost feel the heat of it from here. A searing heat that incinerates everything it touches, yeah. leaving nothing but ashes. Okay, you don't need the... Just 200 years ago. fancy language. This was the last thing most saw before their world came to an end. Yes, I know. Those who died in the nuclear fire were the lucky ones. Yeah, I know. I've thought about this a it lot. It was those who had to survive in the scarred remains of the old world who endured the okay, most stop, suffering. Stop waxing philosophical. It almost makes you wonder why they even bothered. Why we even bother. Feeling down? Why are we still here? Just to suffer? <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> I guess we should focus more on how far we've risen, rather than how far we've fallen. Let's go back to base. Right. Let's go. Hooray! Yay! Horrible things just happened. Another successful mission where we accidentally kill everybody and then set off a nuke. Yes. Let me guess. He nuked our base. Uh, how you holding up? Everything going okay? I'll be fine once we finally leave this frozen hell. Frontier's been rough. Especially the entire NCR campaign. <laughs> it's been really rough. We've all been through a lot. I'm just glad it's finally almost over. What are you gonna do back in California? I don't know. Maybe find somewhere quiet. It feels like I've been fighting all my life. I can't remember the last time I just tried to settle down and clear my mind. You see that? There's another vertebrate. What, what are they doing all the way out here? Where? Look in the monitor. Oh no, they're gonna crash into us. Oh no. That was a close flyby. Let me guess. It's probably Tiberius Rancor. Or it's, a, it's a Legion airship! Oh no! Spider webs came out of the helicopter! What are we shooting at? We're friendly! Hold your fire! They're not friendly though! They can't they can't hear you. Fuck! They're going to shoot us down! Go out there and return fire! Use the machine gun and turrets in the back! Go now! Okay, I'm working on it. Ooh, turrets. <laughs> they're, they're a little scree right now. <laughs> it's a bunch of NCR soldiers. Hey, you guys got to stop betraying the NCR. Yeah, stop betraying the NCR and betray the NCR with us. The NCR betrayers. I mean, exiles. Robot, are you going to be okay? <laughs> Oh, goodness. It's having some real problems. You know what? They, it could be worse. Oh, no. He's fixed. They're fixed. Okay, okay. We don't want to shoot NCR soldiers. Stand down for, if you would be so kind, please. Please? Can I make this explode? Maybe put a lot more bullets into it. Ow, ow. God bless it. That one I exploded. Okay, so see, we got this guy. 
but he's gone now, so he can't shoot missiles at us anymore. There's number one, and a couple of you guys are gonna pop you out without shooting our own ship if we... Oh, okay then. That's unfair, but all right. They were hiding behind the fin of your ship! Oh, maybe we should have crouched. Oh. Have you given up? Have you surrendered? Have you acknowledged your own inferiority? I don't see any there. I don't they, see any there. Yeah, they must have given up. Oh, boy! The, or not! Or that just happens. Courier! We need to jump aboard another vertebrate! Uh, okay, let's go. Good. On my mark. Uh, is that where we're going? Okay. <laughs> they got a one and a two and a jump on in. Hey. Go. Oh, were you waiting for her? I was waiting for her to say go. Oh, okay. She said on my mark, so I was waiting for her to say go. <laughs> she didn't say anything because I think she fell to the floor. She glitched oh <laughs> out of the helicopter. <laughs> this broken fucking mod. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Geronimo! No! <laughs> Okay, you can kind of jump, but they exploded when you landed. <laughs> yeah. Okay, we know you can make the jump, though. That's good. Well, we think we can make the jump. Yes. <laughs> Woo! Oh, there we go. Jump! Hey, you should have waited until she said jump! Oh, well. Oh, you actually made it. Holy shit. I landed on the roof. Don't worry. I'm still here. I know you were concerned about me. I, I Don't worry. I'm definitely ducking all these rotor blades. Why are these assholes attacking us? They look like NCR. Did Kimball send them? Fuck. What happened to the negotiations Blackthorn was supposed to be having with them right now? Something isn't right. Well, they probably were like, yeah, you're not actually a certified Fallout faction, so, uh, no. Uh, here's a cease and desist letter. I'm sure the pilot can tell us something. We'll have no problem taking him by surprise. We were just yelling! Why are you whispering now? This is Red 6. The oh, target's shit. aboard of my vertebrate. I repeat, the targets Courier. are aboard Red 6. Take control of the vertebrate! Okay. I'll deal with the pilot. How do I fly a fucking helicopter? <laughs> well, you didn't learn? Oh, God bless it! Yeah, get ready. This is this is the, the vertebrate. How do I move up and down? Oh, we should have actually looked at the tutorial. A couple of uh, vertebrates are coming after us. Don't worry, AJ, we'll protect you. By, and by that I mean we'll shoot down any other incoming NCR. Oh, man, it's really not great when we're shooting down NCR dudes. It's not gonna look great on our record. Yeah, not really, especially considering. Oh, do I actually? I actually do have to fly. Our reputation is gonna be so soured. Terrain, terrain. Don't sink. Don't sink. Pull up. Pull up. Oh no, you're flying right into the artillery fire that froze in midair! Please tell me this is the boss battle you were talking about. I'm pretty sure, uh, well, <laughs> uh, yeah, this is the first stage of the boss oh, battle. Oh, for fuck's sake! <laughs> now, I've done this boss battle before, and luckily he flies in a very predictable fashion where he flies over, goes left, flies over, goes right, and does it over and over and over again, so. He's gonna fly over, go to the right. Well, none of my missiles are fucking hitting him, so yeah. I don't know what you want me to do. Go to the left. And going to the right. And going to the left. And going to the right. All right, he exploded! EA! Yay! EA Sports, it's in the game! I hope Rancor was on that! Who's piloting the vertebrate? Start talking! You won't get anything from me. Do your worst. I won't talk. Why'd you attack us? I'm not at liberty to tell you that. I get the feeling you guys were here for me. If you're the one they refer to as Courier 6, then yes, our orders were to eliminate you. Punch. Ugh. Punch. Ugh. Punch. Ugh. 
Punch. Ugh. I don't feel like we're getting anywhere. Punch. Ugh. You're only wasting your time. There's much more going on here than you realize. It's already too late to stop it. Look at me. Look at me in my eyes! Do you know what I have seen? The horrors I have witnessed! You see these scars? I've been through hell. I have experienced unimaginable pain and suffering at the hands of the Legion. She had a bad time. I've learned how someone can be stripped of everything they have. She had a real Even bad time. Nothing but a hollow shell. You're going to tell me everything you know, or I'm going to destroy who you once were. Okay. Okay. I'll tell you everything I know. We're part of an NCR first recon strike force, under orders from Congress to assassinate Courier 6. Why does Congress want me, capital T, the capital C, Courier, dead? To be more specific, it was certain members of Congress who secretly ordered the attack. An order that even went behind Gimbal's back. You see, like Blackthorn, there are other powerful and influential figures who also want to contest the Kimball presidency. But they don't want Blackthorn to be the one who takes power afterwards. Especially now that they are aware of Blackthorn's secret weapon. Are you talking about the Liberator? Are you talking about that big stupid hover helicarrier thing? Whatever it is, they want it and are willing to expend whatever resources necessary to obtain it. That still doesn't explain why they want me dead. The Courier is just a scapegoat for Blackthorn's death. What do you mean? What happened to Blackthorn? Oh, I'm sure you saw it. Couldn't have missed it. It happened just moments ago. And maybe you even had something to do with it. <laughs> the nuke! It detonated in California. That's why the blast was so close. Rancor betrayed us. Oh my god, how could he? We figured it out, yay. Yeah, I figured it out a long fucking time ago. I, however, didn't call that Rancor was still working for the NCR. That bastard was selling us out from the beginning. I can't believe I didn't realize it sooner. Yeah, it was pretty obvious. Yeah, it was very obvious. So now what? We need to head to where that nuke detonated and see if there is any chance Blackthorn survived it. We'll be flying straight into the nuclear crater, so be prepared. All right, fine, let's go to the nuke zone. See, now there would actually be radioactivity. <laughs> yeah. Now that it's gone <laughs> off. It wouldn't be that bad right now, because it's, well, I don't know. Yeah, right now it wouldn't be terrible. Everything would fucking be on fire. But it wouldn't be that bad. It's only when it starts to rain afterwards that all the fallout, hence the name, <laughs> starts to come down. Oh, yes.